second Ezra chapter 4 verse 28 but as concerning these things whereof thou askest me I will tell thee for the evil is sown but the destruction is not yet come yeah, yeah. the destruction of the rub is not yet look come that, look at that look at that look at that Ooh, about to clean your fucking clock stop at the fucking red light man and you it's the fucking red light right there so if the Lord probably cut their damn car off because it would have been a collision but I'm glad he did that. That way traffic can keep coming through. And motherfuckers that don't stop, they ain't gonna have an excuse. Well, the car accident that day, so I had to go to nah. Keep on coming, traffic. Look at that. It's a fucking red light. It's the line is right here. Right. Why are you gonna stop in the crossway anyway? That's the second almost accident. That's too possible. That's too possible. All right, they say third time's the charm. Let's see. He says, uh, but as concerning the things whereof thou askest me, I will tell thee. For the evil is sown, but the destruction thereof is not yet come. If therefore that which is sown be not turned upside down, and the place where the evil is sown pass not away. And the what? The place where the evil is sown pass not away. Not the... Not, not the evil, the place, okay? Not the evil, the place, not the action, but the action now, the place. So just like, the, the same as with sin, okay? The sin is going to get destroyed, but it's still to the sinner too. The sin is going to get destroyed by the sinner being destroyed. The evil and the wickedness is going to be destroyed by the place being destroyed, man. By signing a peace treaty? No, by way of destruction from the heavenly father. That's, uh, that's, that's 2 Peter's the third chapter tells you that. Saying that all uh, the world and all the works therein shall be burned up. You know? Here it is, you have Genesis, right? The Lord flooded the earth. <laughs> Killed everything and everybody except eight people and the animals that he saved. All right, eight people out of the whole earth. I can name eight people I went to school with and haven't seen in years. That's how many people made it through a total destruction, man. Right? But you'll read that and just be like, "Woo, that's crazy." I thought the map fit together like a puzzle. Like, no, really think about why he did it. What he did, all right, how he did it, and why he did it, and when he did it, you know? Yes, it happened in the past, but it doesn't mean that that situation can't come back. Because the scripture tell you it's gonna come back, not the same way, but by a different cleansing, fire. You got two main cleansers, you got water, and you need to wash something off, you got fire, you burn out the impurities, man. So that's what the Lord is going to do by a way of nuclear fire, it's going to burn out the impurities. Alright? It's just like when niggas, you need a healing. <laughs> it's like when niggas hit, niggas hit a lick or something, and they want to get rid of a car, what do they do? They set that bitch on the fire, you know? Why? Because fire destroys everything. Destroys all the evidence. You won't, you won't get fingerprints. None of that. Fire destroys everything. Water cleanses everything as well, man. You know. Hey, spirit, we saw the rainbow again. You know today. Yep. We got out. Yep. Yep. And that 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 sign, that rainbow is not a sign for gay pride. Okay. So the fact that you using that as that, I pray all you faggots drown, man. All right. Just for you using the symbol that the Lord gave a covenant with the earth. Every this is for everybody. This is everybody. I'm not gonna send a flood again, man. Since y'all big on everybody in the covenant. Yeah, yeah. Since y'all wanna be so part of Israel. Alright. That's y'all, that's the covenant that he made with y'all, man. He wasn't gonna flood the earth. Alright? He never said nothing about fire though. So don't try to call him. You said you wouldn't destroy the whole. He never said nothing that he wouldn't. He, he made like a this. covenant by water. 
if therefore that which is sown be not turned upside down. Yeah, if it not be turned upside down, meaning go the other way. Okay, go ahead. And if the place where the evil is sown pass not away, then cannot it come that which is sown with good. Yeah, then can read that again. Read that again. They move from downtown. Yeah, we don't own the sidewalk. Y'all welcome to walk. You, know? you guys used to be downtown all the time, right? Oh uh, yeah, we used to be downtown. But I used to I work. I just saw you guys like every week. Oh okay. Or said, don't stop till he come. We gotta keep going. Okay. If the place where the evil is sown pass not away, then cannot it come that is sown with good. But what's sown with good? The kingdom. The kingdom. New Jerusalem. Uh, as it is in heaven uh, on earth, man. On earth as it is in heaven. Oh, that makes love. That's what that's saying. As above, so above, so above. You know, but that's pretty much what it is. That, that glory that's in heaven is going to be on earth, man. That's the good. We're not going to take our land back and Esau can stay over in America and still piss in the ocean and drop oil in it and, and pollute the whole earth. No, that place, man. And with that place comes those people, man. And with that people come that mindset and that ideology. All of that is going to be destroyed, man. So that good can come. Everybody want the second coming. Everybody want to make it to heaven. Well, heaven's going to come to you. <laughs> you know? If you don't get there first. You know what I'm saying? Delivery or pickup? Delivery. <laughs> delivery or pickup? <laughs> delivery. <laughs> delivery or pickup? Pickup, delivery. No, I said pickup, delivery. Yeah. They want to make their own way to the kingdom. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's <laughs> so a book of Isaiah, chapter 30. They even set up for Tostitos, whatever that shit is. Tostitos? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I always throw an S in there, bro. Yeah, that's awesome. Okay. Tostitos? 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 It's the book of Isaiah, chapter 30. In verse 12, it says, Wherefore thus saith the Holy One of Israel, because you despise his word, you trust in oppression and perverseness, and stay there wrong. That's right, you you didn't trust in the word, you trusted in America and all the, the, the faggy shit, all the, the, the bakery that goes on in this place, man. It says, Therefore, this iniquity shall be to you as a breach ready to fall. That's right, just like a wall that's ready to fall, all right? It's gonna come at a sudden. It says, who's breaking coming suddenly at an instant. Right, man. You're gonna be surprised. You're gonna get caught with your pants down. Like the scripture said before. Nobody knows the time or the hour. So while you up here partying and you into whatever you went to, that's when the Lord's gonna come back, man. You ain't gonna be ready. And yeah, that's why it's our job just to come and teach the word and not beg you. To, you know, we're, not, we're not begging nobody to understand the word. The Lord already said she gonna hear his voice anyway. So we ain't out here to beg. Yeah. No, we just we gonna, we gonna do our job as the Lord said. You know, wash our hands with you know, people that don't wanna get it. That's on you now. You know? It's just like music. You got all these different genres of music, but every every genre of music ain't for every person, you know what I'm saying? Everybody like their own genre of music. So this is our music. And it's only for the elect. Only the elect is going to tune into this station. You're going to be like, what the, what the fuck is this? You're going to ride past trying to read the sign. And you know, just get out the car. Just get, you ain't got time. You ain't got two minutes. Hey, what, what is this on the sign? Or why ain't, why ain't my people on the sign? Ba 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 ba. Oh man, dang, y'all dumb. Then you go about the way. Like, well, at least you know. You ain't gotta sit here and wonder, you know, ride past all the fucking depth, all the fucking time and just, uh, just, uh, curious. Alright? Isaiah, Isaiah 1, it says, my people don't, don't know, they don't even consider. Yeah. If the father came to another nation, surely they would have listened. Here it is. 
And then that, that's why the Lord created another nation, which was the elect. Because within Israel, you have different nations, man. That cluster that, that, that had that blessing in it, that was another nation. All right? When you read about the heathens in uh, Second Ezra, the second chapter that he went to, that was the elect, man. But it sounds like he's going to the actual heathen. It sounds like the heathen can be saved. You gotta, hey, you gotta precept upon precept, man. Get that understanding. Rightly divide the word of truth. And rightly divide the word of truth. Study to show yourself approved. I always say that approved is accepted, man. All right, the Lord don't want no half-ass studying nigga. All right, I'm cool with the basics. No. Now, if you sincerely trying to increase it, just the Lord just got a study block on you, so to speak, then hey, you can't do nothing against that, all right? But if if you just like, fuck it, I'm cool with this, then what, then what? That's where you're gonna be stuck at, you're gonna be stagnant, you're gonna, hey, you end up getting left behind, man. Because the Lord tell you that the Lord wrote letters to them like, y'all supposed to be in increased, man. All right, what does that increase? Get better, you know? The church of Berea. All right, they weren't cool with you just saying, you uh, they weren't cool with you just saying, that it's talking about the First Thessalonians, fifth chapter, and uh, I'll start back from verse two. It says, for yourselves know perfectly that the day of the Lord so cometh as a thief in the night, for when they shall say peace and safety, then sudden destruction cometh upon them as travail upon a woman with child, and they shall not escape. It says, but ye brethren, as, as travail upon a woman with child, shall not escape. Because till this day, women still can't escape that pain. All right, as a whole, some some women do just have no pain. Some women have so much pain they try to get a uh, epidural, but it still don't help. You know what I'm saying? Basically, as that pain is always going to be there, so is this sudden destruction, man. It's just right around the corner. All right, America's almost about to have the, the, the baby of destruction. Oh, who's that nigga name? The only little kid, uh, Damien. Damien. Yeah. <laughs> America's going to have baby. <laughs> Downtown. Oh. You fuck that? Yeah. What was that Boston? 